Welcome to Nature Vision. Welcome to subscribe today so you never miss a video. Long ago, deep in the vast ocean, there lived a group of sharks as a happy and united family. The shark family consisted of the grandpa and grandma sharks, the mom and dad sharks, and their little sharklings. They loved being together, cherishing each other's company, swimming and searching for delicious food. They always lent a helping fin to one another, with the grandpa and grandma sharks being wise and experienced passing down their wisdom about life and the ocean to the young ones. In this loving family, they were all grateful for the wonders of God's creation. They knew that God created the vast ocean and all living creatures, including themselves. In the Bible, it is written, and God said, let the waters teem with living creatures and let birds fly above the earth across the vault of the sky. Genesis 120 sharks are among the marvelous creatures that God brought forth living in the ocean and becoming an essential part of its ecosystem. Sharks also offered benefits to humans. They help maintain the ecological balance of the ocean by controlling the population of other marine creatures, ensuring biodiversity in the sea. Additionally, people obtained food and other valuable resources from sharks. The shark family deeply appreciated God's love and protection. Every time they swam amidst the magnificent ocean, marveling at the spectacular sights God had created, they felt immense, gratitude, and reverence. This story reminds us of the wonders of God's creation and how he bestowed each creature with unique functions and meanings. Let us, like the shark family, be grateful for God's love and care. Love one another and lead a life filled with joy. This story reminds us of the wonders of God's creation and how he bestowed each creature with unique functions and meanings. Let us, like the shark family, be grateful for God's love and care. Love one another and lead a life filled with joy. Welcome to subscribe today so you never miss a video.